my family own Glenskinnell Farm. Uh, recently we got involved with uh, Mark and Tom Newell who own Absolute Soul and Wind and we decided to create a new business called Glenskinnell Biofuels. What's really exciting about this is having done a joint venture with the Goals and ourselves, we're going to be using this site as a research site. So we want to link it into universities so that we can actually get some academic statistics on drying floors because currently there's not that information out there. So we see this as very much a research and ongoing developing energy site. This is obviously a large scale commercial system uh, that is obviously not going to be for the majority of people's requirements but it allows them to see something and from our business obviously the main thing we are doing is promoting the sale of wood chip um, but we can also um, expand and look at other options such as log drying, grain drying um, and other markets that become available to us and obviously with that close link with Absolute um, as a company and having Mark and Tom as partners in Grand Skinner Biofuels then that very close link in the knowledge base um, is very very important. There's a, a, a local demand in the community for wood chip, something that's grown uh, in recent years because of the number of people that are starting to install biomass systems. It comes back to if you put a, a wet log on a fire that sizzles, you don't get a great deal of heat out of it. The, the main thing is you want to get a high calorific output from your boiler, you want it to be burning at its optimum and you want it to have a good energy. Bad or wet wood chip then it causes serious wear and tear in boilers, you know, just generally not a nice constant clean burn. The best thing you want is a high quality wood chip that gives a, a nice consistent burn. So spent a lot of time researching different boilers different floor drying systems uh, and researching different designs as well, how the boilers interface with the, with the floor drying. Okay, what happens is we have five boilers uh, from Froling in Austria and they are used to generate energy um, through wood chip to dry wood chip. So basically what happens is dry wood chips fed um, into the boilers and that in turn generates and creates air that's fed into drying floors that has been put into a, a grain store. These five drying floors have the capacity to dry 250 tonnes of wet wood chip per week, um, which out turns about 170 to 190 tonnes of dry wood chip each week. But what we're able to do is we're able to reach out to local communities, we're able to provide them with affordable fuel, and we can also help them to install biomass systems as well. It is local, it is renewable, it is sustainable, and we have the full quality control process in place at each stage that we can check and measure and um, we know exactly batch on batch um, what requirements certain customers will need and we can meet them.